Hello everyone and welcome back to Happy Soul in You. In this video, I am going to share with you what's in my diaper bag. Suppose we are traveling for a two-day trip. Say Saturday morning we'll be leaving and then Sunday night we'll be returning. Considering that particular scenario, I have packed this diaper bag. While I'm showing you things, I will also say what are the things you may not need to carry. Suppose you're going on a day trip. one day trip where you leave in the morning and come back in the night now the first particular thing that i want to mention is how to choose a diaper bag choose a diaper bag which has a lot of pockets however most of the diaper bags will be designed in such a way that there are a lot of pockets so that you can categorize your items when you're placing it in your diaper bag Now this particular diaper bag was gifted to me by my beautiful friend even though I didn't get to choose the diaper bag for myself whatever she chose for me is the best one I love the color I love how many pockets it has and another best part is the handles that are provided for this bag there are three ways in which we can carry this bag one is you have small handles you can carry it this way as well Another handle that is provided is this long one you can just put it on your shoulder like a sling bag it is too long you can adjust the size length based on your height and next is you can carry it like a backpack and i usually carry it like a backpack because it's very convenient to me because i can put it on my back as well as i can carry my baby comfortably Now suppose if you like this diaper bag and if you are planning to buy one for yourself then I will link this product in the description because I found this bag in Amazon and by the way this video is not sponsored by anybody now let's see what's in my diaper bag in the first section I have placed diapers considering that we are traveling for 2 days I have placed around 8 to 9 diapers here Basically in this section I have kept all the items that I would need when I'm changing my baby's diaper for example extra diapers wet wipes and the diaper rash cream are kept in this section along with some other items which I will show you soon Here is a packet of wet wipes and there are three sections you can see here let's see each section one by one Now in the first section I have placed socks and mittens in this I have bib and another is diaper rash cream I carry socks and mittens wherever I go irrespective of the weather because you never know in the night it may be cold so I carry it and then here is a bib which I use when I'm feeding my baby now that my baby takes solids she is 10 months old I will need bib because I don't want to make her clothes dirty and then in the next section is my diaper rash cream which i will be needing when i'm changing the diaper so this entire section is dedicated for diaper changing and some other small items now moving on let's see what are the items present in our two side pockets now in the first side pocket we can see that there are toys carrying toys are very important when we are traveling so that we can keep our baby busy and occupied You can carry toys based on your child's age. Here I have carried lots of teethers because nowadays she is putting everything inside her mouth. Maybe because she is in the process of teething, and also I have carried her water bottle. So these are the items present in this side pocket. Now let's see what's in the other side pocket. Now in this side pocket, I have kept my baby's powder, and also there is this kajal box. which we use you can see that there is a kind of opening here this section is usually used for keeping baby wipes but i'm not comfortable keeping it there so i use it for keeping my baby's powder box now another best part about this diaper bag is that we also get a diaper changing mat along with this bag which is so good it matches with the bag and it's so easy to carry the size is perfect to make our baby sleep on this mat and change the diaper you can use this mat whenever you're changing diaper inside your car or wherever you go so that's another good part about this bag there is also a section provided at the back side of the bag where you can place this diaper changing mat or you can keep it inside wherever you're comfortable as well i don't mind keeping it here so i keep it here Now let's see what's inside the main compartment. I'm opening the zip and there you go. There are lot of items here. 
बिकॉज आई जस्ट के नॉट रिस्क इट वैन इट कम्स टू माई बेबी आई जस्ट कैरी एवरी थिंग पॉसिबल नाउ द फर्स्ट वन दैट यू कैन सी इज अ फ्लास्क वी कैरी फ्लास्क बिकॉज वी गिव हॉट वाटर टू आर बेबी लाइक एवरी वन डू एंड देन वी ऑल्सो यूज दिस फॉर मिक्सिंग सिरलैक बिकॉज वेन एवर वी आर ट्रेवलिंग वी फीड आर बेबी सिरलैक सो वी नीड हॉट वाटर टू मेक सिरलैक and this particular bag is my baby's medicine bag or pouch in which all the medicines are present which she needs i know it's huge and there are a lot of items in this even though sometimes we don't use this at all just to be on a safer side i carry it yes we can buy outside whenever we need whenever we are traveling but i just don't want to unnecessarily pile up medicines and then throw it away when i already have it so i carry it with me wherever we go this particular pouch takes a lot of space in my diaper bag and let's see what's next in our diaper bag there are three boxes which is dedicated for my baby's food there is a formula powder box there is serlac powder box and then there is homemade powder which is ragi wheat and almond mix suppose we get any gas stove or induction facility then we can make this ragi wheat and almond powder mix porridge for our baby and then there is one more toy because any number of toys you carry it's less we need to keep entertaining our baby with different toys they get bored too soon now this particular pouch i carry my baby silver bowl and spoon yes i feed my baby with this bowl and spoon so whenever i go anywhere i carry it with me so that i can whip this relax in this bowl and serve it to my baby now next is this bath towel suppose you are going on a one day trip wherein you are not staying anywhere then you may not need a bath towel but we are staying for a day so i'm carrying bath towel and then inside this big compartment there are a lot of sections here there are four sections on the front and the back side and also there are two sections each sides now let's see what's in each of the compartments now three of the compartments are used to store clothes i have carried three pairs of clothes and then in one section i have carried my baby's hand towels and a cap just in case we need a cap if we are going under a hot sun situation and then there is a comforter or a blanket sort of a thing which we carry because if we are staying somewhere we would prefer to use our own blanket for our baby now in this small section i have kept my baby's bath essentials here is the body wash and then in a small bottle i have carried some shampoo actually this big bottle of body wash is not needed but my travel size bottles are all worn off i am not able to use them so i am carrying this entire bottle but preferably it's good to transfer it into a small travel size bottle when we are carrying them because we don't want our bags to be too heavy unnecessarily right just if in case we are traveling for a day we don't need a big bottle now in this small section there is all uh, my baby's body lotion face cream and a comb so yeah these are the items that i carry whenever i go with my baby for a one day stay but there are some items you can skip if you are not going to stay and if it's just a one day morning to evening trip I hope you found this video useful if yes then do let me know in the comment section below also please don't forget to hit the thumbs up button and if you haven't subscribed to my channel yet then do subscribe to my channel see you in the next video till then bye bye